Okay, so what is up everybody on YouTube? Welcome back to Tubus Gaming HD. We're back in Farming Simulator 2017 and as always. So you can see right here I'm standing right in front of the Fent 939 Rario. And then we got a big plow right here. And that is why I'm going to show you guys today how to make bigger fields in this game. As you know from my latest... Um, my latest episode, I am doing something great up on field number 5. I'm making a big field with only weed in it and I want to put field number 5 and field number 9 together. So that is what we are going to do today. So I'm gonna take this big plow and the big fin right here up to field number 5. And then we're gonna, I'm gonna show you guys how to put fields together and how to make bigger fields in this game uh, to some of you who don't actually kn knew that so uh, I'm gonna show you guys that and I got the big plow right here you can see this plow is insane it's, it's insane how big it is actually and we got the Fint 939 Mario with twin wheels on uh, ready to head up there with the big plow so that is going pretty good this right now and we can take a look inside it as I saw in the latest in the latest episode I also took an inside view on the caterpillar and in the fast track so right here we also got a TV screen uh, to show the TV screen actually show you how the, um, the equipment actually work in the field and so on and then you got a joystick to go forward and stuff like that I guess and we got a steering wheel so right now we're just going ahead I'm, I'm gonna turn left right here well how are we gonna do that maybe we should do that like this oh it, it it went okay it's okay I guess so this right here is a pretty amazing setup I just love the fend with the big twin wheel setup you can see that and then we got this plow right here this, this plow is a man it's it's so it's like a man popped on on testosterone motherfucker just look at it so I'm just heading up here and that it actually went pretty quick because this this tractor right here can go 60 kilometers per hour that's pretty good for a tractor like this and yeah, so you can see the field is over there on the right. We also got some green stuff popping up already. Uh, but you can see field number 9 is this one where we have some corn in it. And that's a little piece of headland right here. And that is the one that we're going to put together. So I'm just going to need some help right here to unfold the plow and so on. Let's see, unfold plow. Allow to create fields. Is it unfolded right now? Okay, so now the plow is actually unfolded, I guess. Um, and this plow is not turnable, so you can't turn this plow around, you just have to go. But that doesn't really matter in the game, because it's actually still doing its job. So now we got the weed, all the weed is already done that right there. That's pretty good. Lower the, f lower the plow, and then we should be able to go. Yeah. So now we're actually creating new fields right here, as you can see. Um, and this plow is actually pretty wide. It has a working width on 6 meters, 6.5 meters or something. So I'm just going to take it all with us right there. It is very important that I get everything with me in the first, first turn right here. That would be great. I'm just going to turn off the help window once again. And just gonna turn it on. So, yeah, now we are actually doing a great job right here. And you can see the setup as I was talking about looks pretty damn amazing. It looks pretty good right here. I don't know if you can hire workers to do this job, but maybe we should try that out. I don't think he can control it though. I don't think he can tr can control it. So maybe it's just best to do this on your own. 
Um, so that is what we're gonna do right now. But we could try uh, when he gonna when he gonna go back. We can try to hire a worker just to see how how it does and how it actually works. So maybe we're gonna try that out. And I can't remember how to lift the plow right here. We have to lift it right here, I guess. Lift the plow. Should be like that. And then we're just gonna turn around right here. And we're gonna go back again. And we're just gonna take a little piece of the field right there, but that's okay. So now I'm gonna press circle to hire worker. Let's see how he does. Okay, he can't do that. He can't actually do that. No, no, he fuck he fucks up. So as I actually thought, you couldn't hire a worker to do the job. That's so sad. Uh, that is really something that needs to get an update in the game. And I've been calling out the creators to do that for a long time, but they, they haven't really done it. Nope. Now we're ready to go again. Allow to create fields, I guess. So, now we're going straight ahead again, and we are just taking this on our own because the worker couldn't figure out how to do it. But, guys, this is how you create fields, actually. You just take a plow, and you press the button Allow to create fields, and then you can actually create new fields. You can plow everything in the game, and it is actually a great option for those of who want a bigger who want the bigger field so that's great um, you just I just take this plow because that is the plow that I want this is the biggest one and it is the one who take the less time to do it with so that's why I bought this but you can actually take any plow that you want and actually do this job with so that's pretty simple you can also take any tractor you want and just do this and I want to give you guys a tip and that is to put field number 25, number 27, number 28, 29 and number 30 together and then you got one big field down there and that, that's a great thing to have I guess because when you got that you can just put on the harvester and it actually just goes straight ahead all down the way in the map and that's pretty pretty damn sick so that is just my opinion on it and I have done that in other games so you guys can do that too that's pretty simple so let's put up right here yeah just turning around again like that and you can see we're actually almost done with this and that's because we got this big plow right here so it doesn't really take that much time to do it and that's great I guess so we're just gonna pull it all together right here we can actually take it all in one turn almost no we can't we're just gonna go back again but then we're done with this and we actually got a little bigger field than it was so that's great that is actually what we wanted to do with this so it's superb god damn this setup is insane man oh shit doing a pretty good job right here Let's see if we can take it all right here. I guess we can take it all just for fun. Almost, almost. Yeah, we took it all right there in one turn. That's pretty, pretty damn good. Pretty awesome. So we're just gonna pull up right here. Boom, boom, boom. Like that. And then we need to get back again, actually. 
Then we need to get back right here. Just gonna put it in the ground. And gonna put on the cruise control as it's called. So we are almost done with this. And then we can put one big field right here with weeds. And guess what we're gonna do next? We're gonna make a huge wheat harvest section. So that is what we're going to do and it will be amazing I guess. The latest thing I do, I, I did a huge wheat harvest in 2015 and that video actually has more than 80. I think it's 80,000 views so that's pretty good and 1,000 likes and that's also good so I want to give a new video of that to you guys and that's why I'm doing this. <coughs> Almost done with this, almost done. Just a little more, just a little more. Whoopsie tips here. Almost, almost. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. We're done with this. So that was actually the video for right now, guys. I just wanted to show you guys how to make bigger fields, and I thought I could actually just do it when I uh, was supposed to do a bigger field, and that's what I've done right here. You can see it. We got one big field right here now. And yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up if you did. And of course, subscribe to the channel. And if you have a question about this, just post a comment down below in the comment section. And that's it. Another thing is, uh, I think you should check out my Danish channel. That's a link in the description. Just press the link and you'll get right to it. So once again, thanks for watching. This is Tupus Gaming HD. And we're going to turn off now. Bye guys.